So I've been wanting to do this for a long time. Boomer shooters are my favorite genre. They're the thing that I grew up with. They're the thing that uh, I kind of enjoy more than anything, any other uh, type of game nowadays. I appreciate the fact that there's actually kind of a modern push to make older first-person shooters. Because first-person shooters is that that's where I'm at. That's my jam. That's, that's always been that's always been my thing. And just recently, about a month ago, Bethesda came out with Doom plus Doom Two, which is essentially remasters of the original two games with some some quality of life things added in, some pretty cool stuff, achievements uh, for the first time at, at least on Steam. I've gone through them a little bit on uh, on normal. But I'm going to start this whole series exactly where it's supposed to start, with Doom. I'll go back and get Wolfenstein, because I know that it's chronologically before this, but we're going to start right here, the way it always... Sh the way it, it should. New game. New Deep in the Dead. We'll be going through all the episodes, and of course, Ultra Violence. You know, I never noticed the difficulties have a period at the end, so it's actually a statement. I'm too young to die, period. Hey, not too rough, period. Ultraviolence, period. That's what we're doing. Alright, let's light this candle. So, I'm really not looking for all the drops or all the kills or secrets or all that kind of stuff. I don't, I don't want to use any resources, I kind of just want to go through this. the way nature intended. The soundtrack for this game, lovingly crafted by the one and only Andrew Holshut, who's rapidly becoming my favorite soundtrack, video game soundtrack guy. Uh, you need to die, hit scanner. You need to die. Let's see. Gonna get bad as soon as I turn this corner. Come on. Whoop. And give me that armor. Turn back around. Oop. Open this door. Of those two. There's a barrel right there to get rid of those dudes. And right there to get rid of those dudes. And there's an amp right here. And there is minimum one secret I forgot. There we go. Pretty sure that's all the kills and secrets. I missed six drops? Wow. Oh. <laughs> Said we weren't really going after drops, but you know, they're helpful. So we'll pick up this stuff. I'm missing one drop. <laughs> oh wait, there it is. Health vial. There we go. That's how we that's how we start right there. Triple one hundred. Get me out of here. Sweet! first episode of Doom, right here, Knee Deep in the Dead, is always the one that I know the best. And the biggest reason is because this first episode was shareware. So, when Doom was brand new, the first episode got passed around. It, it was free. Uh, you could find it in magazines, or you could find it, you know, just about anywhere. And it kind of got passed around, you know, through all of us. And... If you didn't buy the game, the first episode was all you had, so we just played the first episode over and over and over and over and over and over again. So, we all just kind of memorized the first level really well. Here's the red key from back in the main hallway. And out here, oh! It's a lot of shotgunners. Thanks for the ammo, guys. 
And I picked up a back. Oh crap! I picked up a backpack, so my uh, shotgun ammo count is now 100 instead of 50. And there's the chain gun. I think I got all the drops out here. Let's go ahead and pick this up since we're not going to be heading anywhere else. I remember this is the map that has the big dark maze too, which is opened, if memory serves, right here. Loop around here, and that takes us to this giant area full of flashing lights and horrible demons and a couple of secrets yep secret right there that you can shoot to open and this goes up to the chainsaw and I think there was it right here yeah can I get all that I did Awful nice of the game for giving me a chainsaw before I meet my first pinky. Clear out this area a little bit. Alright, the secret is right here. I don't even remember what this is. Oh, it's just a backpack? There's a secret right here where you can get the jump on the people, the guys in this room. It looks like I'm shooting at that guy, and I am, but I'm actually kind of shooting at the guys underneath, too. You can see how my uh, targeting reticle, how it lights up red. That means there's somebody underneath me that the game wants, knows that I'm trying to shoot. It looks like that's everyone. Yep. Oh, wait. Man, this is a big room right here. It was a big room. Come on. No, oh, I'm missing one. Missing one enemy and one drop. <laughs> I am pretty sure it's back there in the big maze and not going back to get that. So, they can just remain alive. Oh, look, here's the last enemy. I didn't know you were down here. Alright, so I missed one drop. I'll go with that. That works. For all the kills, almost all the items, and all the secrets. The secrets are the big part. I'm not going to get 100% secrets on all, all of them. Right now, we're just in a, a part of the game that I know really well. There's a barrel in there I'm going to try to hit. There we go. I did some good to clear them out. Aww. Those are my favorite kind of rooms. The rooms that have a, a big, varied number of enemies. Doom 2 has a lot of that. A lot of the big, big, just overwhelming monster closets that have all kinds of stuff in them. Oh! Fireballs coming out of the dark. Yep, here's that uh, soul sphere that I saw. Which is quite handy. Give me that. I could have sworn there was, oh no, I was going to say I thought there was a button, but there's not a button, it's a, uh, a path you got to go down over here. I'm pretty sure it's this one. Hit that button. There's a trap right here, of course.
let's let that go all the way up and then let's blow up some barrels Ooh. that was effective And here's the exit, but it's the exit we're not taking because that just takes you to the next level. We don't do the next level when there's a secret level. Oh no! Lots of imps. That's the secret exit. I know there's a secret right here. This is that plateau that's above the that area that I was at a second ago. I missed two secrets. I'm not exactly sure where they are. Wait a minute. What did I just hear? Right there. Right here. So here's a, a secret. I, I, I assume this is a secret that opens whenever you step down off that staircase or take that one little step back there. Some of the drops I missed. Oh, here's the yellow door. Man, I forgot all about this. I guess I could have got that invisibility sphere. But we'll settle for taking the soul sphere after the fact. It wouldn't have saved us anything. That is all the kills, too. I'm missing one secret. But, a bunch of ammo, rocket launcher, chain gun, chainsaw. I'm missing one secret, but I got all the kills. Alright. I can live with that. Almost all the items. Only missing one secret. But we did get the secret level. Uh, let's see. Get away, hit scanners, get away. Oh, just turn the corner on me. God dang it. Oh. That pinky got hit in the back of the head with a fireball. That's hilarious. Give me that. Where are you at? Come here. Come here. Raw meat. Mmm. Love it. If I remember correctly, there's a teleporter on that star so if I shoot and alert them do they come pouring through there I guess not all right let's try it out oh that's what I had to do I knew it I knew it had something to do with the teleporter oh Come on, man. No more ammo on you guys. Oh, Lord. Well, we got some infighting happening. A little bit. Whoa! Let's get out of here. Alright. I could have sworn that one of these rooms had like a, a corner that dropped. Oh, yeah, like this.
And I think this is one of the secrets. Whoa. Yeah, it was. So I don't really guess it matters which one of these I can go up. They both go the same place. Back up to the top. Hmm. So, <laughs> chainsaw might not be the best idea here. No, while they're while they got some range, let's do this. Gonna thin the herd down a little bit. There we go. Oh. Oh, oh, there's so many specters. Uh-oh. Yeah, we might have some real problems here. Oh, let me get back up here. All right. <laughs> Ran in there and got behind me somehow. And let's check out down here. Uh oh. How do I get out? I could have sworn I heard that was right there. Oh, this hurts so much. God dang it, come on. Down to 39 health. Mercy. Down to 19 health. Oh crap, there's another one. Living dangerously. That's all the kills. I'm going to scrounge around for a minute and see if I can find some more health before we go to the next stage. Probably not, but... Oh, look, there's some. Oh, there's another one. Big one. Up to 69 health. There's another one. There's 79 health. Left one secret behind, but I guess that's okay. Got all the kills. I think I have 100% kills on all of it so far. Oh, I remember this part. There's kind of a one-way uh, secret where you can... Or I don't know if it's a secret, but... You can get up on top of the platform up there, but you only have one shot at it. I did remember that part. <laughs> oh! What the heck? Where's the chainsaw? Mercy. I heard a demon or a pinky or a specter. Where are you at? Oh, there you are. Oh! Need to hit this button. I have no idea what that did. Let's open this door. Kill these jabronis. Oh, there's a twofer. There's the exit. go this way. Looks like that just takes you back up. 
Just making sure that that switch is what that elevator was for. This just goes back up to here. Yeah. That's just a straight up way out. What's this way? That's where this guy was hiding. Alright. That's two of the three secrets. You know, I wanted to check one more thing because I know in one of these in one of these levels there's an exit or a uh, a secret right at the beginning. Is it over here? Yep, there it is. I knew it. I knew it. I 100 percent of this one too. <laughs> All right. Yes, sir. Whoa! <laughs> oh, I love the sound of infighting. There is, I know, one secret over there in that corner. Ooh, that was effective. Come on. Die, Pinky. Alright, so we got rid of all those dudes. I know that there's a secret right here. Yes, sir. Big armor. Rocket launcher, which I didn't need. Whoa! Come here, you jerk. Oh! You son of a bitch. Oh. Oh, he wants that imp. Look at this. He wants that imp. Get him. Get him. <laughs> oh no! I'm gonna swap to uh, chain gun for the moment. I'm pretty sure something's fixing to happen and a bunch of bad stuff's gonna open up behind me. Ah, I was right. Oh! Ah, go away, barrel. There we go. Oh, the chain gun's a lot of fun. All right. Let's try that on the other side. I do need some health. Oh, I remember this part too. Secret right here. Get that suit. Chainsaw. And this goes outside. That's like a triple secret too. For some reason it only gave me credit for the secret level on my way back in. Kind of interesting. Get that barrel. There we go. Ha! Nice. Oh!
Stacking them up, man. Stacking them up. Oh, boy. Oh. An extremely dark room. Usually they have, uh... Somewhere down here is probably going to be some of those, um... Uh, glasses. The... Not the x-ray goggles, but the... Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is bad. Oh! Oh, thank you, Lord. Oh! Oh, these dark rooms are terrible. Alright. I'm good with that. Oh, yeah. Ha, <laughs> ha. I remember this is my favorite room of the first episode. I don't remember exactly how this is going to work, but not how with it. It's going to be a lot more than this. Jump across to right here. Oh! Holy crap, okay. Oh! Come on, God! Sorry, buddy. I'm gonna try this direction. Oh, sweet. I've got instincts taking over. Look at this. Look at this. Look at all this. Look at this. And an invisibility orb. Alright. Oh, I can't go this way now. Oh, I see how that works. I had to go hit that button to lower that wall to get the sphere. Oh! Well. Conveniently placed. Ooh! Uh oh. He didn't make it. That switch opens. It's a door somewhere here in this maze. I got the computer area map too, so that'll make things a little easier. Here, this is what it opened. There's a the yellow key. Okay. Nice. Alright. Whoa! Any amount of infighting would be just fine. Wow. And somehow that giant trap and I didn't get shot once. Let's grab this and go check this out. Uh, 
Another secret. Ooh! Oh yeah. Oh, you jerk. Snuck up behind me somehow. Ah! God dang it, that guy just sat there and unloaded two shotgun blasts right in the side of my head. Oh, Lord. Oh, boy. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is a lot of guys. Oh, come on. I knew this room wasn't done. I didn't know it had this much in it. There's not going to be anything left in this chain gun. I'm emptying the whole thing. Ooh. Whew. <laughs> Uh-oh. The audacity. Good grief. I made a mess. There's the last enemy on the map. Stuck in the wall. Alright. Oh, man. Okay, so I did pretty good on that one. Well, it's safe to say that I have officially pissed these guys off. I know it goes without saying, but the shotgun, the Doom shotgun, I know the SSG comes later, but just the, the, the normal combat shotgun in this game. It's such a boss weapon. It's such a workhorse. Oh. As I get my face shot off by a shotgun. Get rid of that barrel. Oh, wait. Nice. Okay, that works. Awesome. Okay, that worked out well. Okay. That was over there. Ooh. There's that. That's cool. Ooh, here's this. That's very cool. Oh, wait. A better idea. There might be some guys in this. Oh. Y'all. That's it. It's 150 kills. I missed one of the secrets. I missed some of the drops. Oh yeah, I killed all these guys too.
Alright. Phobos Anomaly. There is one secret in this room, or in this, uh, in this place. I think these lifts only go up once. Nope, I'm wrong. Nice. Alright. Ah, we know what's gonna happen. Let's do it. Come on. And that's a wrap. So imagine being a kid and having the shareware version and you get to the end right here and then this is how the whole thing ends. And then you can't you can't go any farther because you have to buy the actual game and you're just a kid and you can't buy the actual game. You don't have enough money and your parents won't buy it for you. And at the time you may not even have a computer that'll run it. Once you beat the big badasses and clean out the moon base, you're supposed to win, aren't you? Aren't you? Where's your fat reward and ticket home? What the hell is this? It's not supposed to end this way. It stinks like rotten meat, but looks like your wall but it looks like the lost Demos base. Looks like you're stuck on the shores of hell. The only way out is through. To continue the Doom experience, play the shores of hell and its amazing sequel, Inferno. So, classic, definitive, E1 of Doom 1. And if you had shareware, like I said, this was all you got. You just got those eight levels, unless you knew where the secret exit was, and then you got the nine levels. Yep, so next time we'll go through Shores of Hell on on uh, ultra violence difficulty.